Call forwarding lets us redirect calls from one phone number to another. For this app, we'll be rerouting incoming calls from our Twilio phone number to a personal phone number. Here's what our finished app will look like inside of Twilio Functions. Twilio Functions is Twilio's serverless JavaScript environment for building applications right inside of the Twilio console. We'll use a Twilio code exchange quick deploy project so that with just the push of a button, we'll be up and running in no time. The most common use case for call forwarding is to use it as a way to redirect calls from a business phone number to a personal phone number. A dedicated business line is a convenient way to add privacy and professionalism to your business and makes it easier for you to share ownership of any incoming calls just by changing the numbers that you forward to. For this call forwarding project, we'll need a Twilio account, a Twilio phone number, and a personal phone number to experiment with. When the call comes into our Twilio number, a function called forward call, we'll accept the incoming call and then dial the new phone number. Great, let's get started. Here I'm on Twilio's code exchange site. And if I scroll down, I'll find a section for quick deploy. These are our projects that are very quick and easy to deploy with very much just the push of a button. So we'll go into the quick deploy apps and I'm going to filter by voice. This will get us to our call forwarding use case, which we'll click on to go to our application. All we need here is our Twilio account, a Twilio phone number, and a personal phone number to test this out with. If I scroll down, if you're not currently logged in, you'll see a login button here. So go ahead and log in. And once you are logged in, you'll want to pick a Twilio phone number. I'm going to reuse the SMS forwarding application from our SMS forwarding video but feel free to choose whatever number you want. If you use the same number that you use to create the SMS forwarding application, you can use this to forward both SMS and calls to the same phone number. Once you've picked your Twilio phone number, just enter in your cell phone number that you want this to forward to, and then hit the deploy this application button down at the bottom. This will take a little bit of time, uh, probably less than a minute. And once it's done deploying, we'll be able to check out the code. Awesome success. Our application has been deployed. At this point, you could make a call to this application and try it out. But first, let's click on go to live application. This page here is generated as part of the deployment to indicate that the app is ready to go. Now that we're here, I'll place a call from my cell phone to the Twilio number and Twilio will call me right back at that same number. Good, we know it's working. Now we can go and edit the application to make some tweaks. Our index HTML is that page we were just looking at that indicated our success. What we're really interested in here is the function up above called forward call. Inside of here, there is some Twimmel that's generated that simply places a call out to the number that's stored in the my underscore phone underscore number environment variable. What we wanna do is before that call is connected, have Twilio read out a message. We can do that with the Twimmel say verb. So we'll come in here and do Twimmel dot say, and then we just need to give it a string to read out when the call is connected. And let's just say something like, uh, you have a new call on the business line connecting you to them now. When that happens, the call will get connected. Twilio will first say, you have a new call on the business line connecting you to them now, and then the phone will ring, connecting you to the other call. With my changes in place, I will click save. Once this is saved, we can click deploy all to deploy the changes to this function. Twilio will build the application and then deploy it to our serverless instance. Awesome, now that our function has been deployed to our function service, we can give our phone number another call. This time we'll hear Twilio say, you have a new call on the business line, connecting you to them now, and then the phone will ring with that new call. You have a new call on the business line. Connecting you to them now. Amazing, the call goes exactly like we expected. That was super easy. Feel free to customize this function further to fit your needs. Code Exchange Quick Deploys really are the quickest way to get up and running with common Twilio use cases. There are Quick Deploy projects for many of Twilio's products. 
Now that you have call forwarding working for your phone number, check out this video to see how to set up SMS forwarding.